yes, the goal really isn't to heal. And I just realized this recently. Not really realized, but it's sort of like dawning on me that it's like, oh, because I've been on this kind of, I guess you can say, not a binge, but like I've been, I really haven't been forcing it because I've never thought that I should force anything because I've, I, I, I re I've learned my lesson in terms of like, you know, the signs that have been showing up and the, you know, the, the, the guidance I've been getting when it comes to healing is that it's okay to not heal at times. It's okay to just go through all that triggers and the darkness and the shadow stuff. For those who don't know what that is, it's basically, you know, any sort of reactiveness that we have to people's words, to our own thoughts, our reaction to our bringing, how we're brought up, the beliefs we have inside, etc., 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 etc. You know, it's really complex to be human, right? But I realize that I've been kind of doing some of the healing stuff because I feel like, you know, in the communities I've been in or the community I'm in now, it's like, well, I don't want to be left behind. I had this one dream where I was basically, um, what was going on there? I, I remember it really, like, it was really vivid. I was in some sort of, like, I don't know what it was, like, in some sort of area. I don't know. I can uh, That I can't remember. But the fact that we were in this sort of team and then we were supposed to like launch and move to another place and it was very strange it was like whoa what is this <laughs> and and we were about to leave but as we were about to leave one of the one of the persons like i guess you can say like a sort of a rocket pack it was like every every individual had their own little ship to go into and they were supposed to move into the next uh, planet or life or whatever it is right and I was there for them and I fixed it. When I say I was there for them, it's just like I, I, I felt like helping them. And I realize now the reason why I said the reason why I said I was there for them is because um, the resulting thing was that out of my desire to help them, I remember this feeling of like, oh, what's wrong with your what's wrong with your jetpack or your pack, or whatever it is, right? And then you know, doing that thing led my led me to be basically not work on mine. So basically, I got. I think I don't know. Maybe because maybe the 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 power ran out, or there was like something wrong. I didn't get to, or oh no no yeah okay now I remember. I didn't have my own. Everybody was kind of going into these pods or something like some sort of ship or something. I can't visualize. I couldn't remember. I I don't remember seeing that it was like a actual ship like it felt like it was supposed to be like a rocket ship of some sort and then anyways um long story short i basically helped this person out this individual and next thing i know i'm left behind so in fact it wasn't like they were flying out of the planet they were actually going in into like underwater or some kind of like it felt weird it was like kind of like clear crystalline but like glassy sort of thing and they were going underneath but i was trapped on the surface and then i woke up from that feeling like like i really felt this dread that i was like wow i'm left behind and that's that so what i'm trying to say here is that that's because i've had dreams like that where i feel left out i have no i'm kind of trapped i can i've never f wanted to have that but then i realized i'm just like I need to work on my, when I say need to, I mean like I, it's a sign for me to learn and grow and be okay with um, being ostracized, being left out, especially, you know, coming out, having all this stuff and, and, you know, not having friends and it was just, you know, just being completely different, even among those who are also different. That's why in my, I have an old video that's, uh, I think I mentioned like, I'm like, I feel like I'm the black sheep of the black sheep of the black sheep of the black sheep. And it's weird. I'm, I'm not trying to really exclude myself, but maybe it is. I feel like maybe that's kind of like a comfort zone. <laughs> um, maybe it's still today. I'm still, you know, learning through it. Um, so basically, for those who have, you know, heard this, it's healing is kind of like going up a staircase, right? But in this case, it's like a long, 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 long staircase. And you keep going up. Eventually you get tired and you fall back. 
or right, you fall and then you stand back up, right? So a lot of people have probably heard of that. You know, it's probably some sort of like broken record thing by now. But what I'm realizing, it's like I've just been fighting with this need to perfect and heal because, again, I don't want to be left out. But that's what I'm learning through. So if you feel like you're one of those people, um, don't worry, you're actually not alone in this. Um, so really, I'm kind of just kind of letting it go and just heal on the way. Heal also just like anything in life that's unpredictable. Heal through the unpredictable. Heal through, you know, you don't, I don't, I don't have to plan it. I just do and then be in the moment and then surrender to it. That's why I also made a video on surrendering. So if you go, you guys want to go watch that, great, awesome. If not, you know what to do. This is my channel. Check it out. Whatever you have, any questions you have, I will not, of course, uh, respond to anything that kind of is very like. Not because it's not triggering, but more like it's not conducive to something that will be helpful to other people. So just to let you know. But other than that, you know, I really welcome things that are, you know, like from insight, from a place of real genuine, like if you feel this way, you know, you owning your emotions, all those things. But that's all I wanted to share today. <laughs> Very short video, but I thought I'd just share that. Thank you for watching again. Bye.